Today I'm going to show you two different offhand attacks in basketball. Which one you use depends upon how quickly you can read your defender's body while you're driving by them. So the defensive part offensively is I have to learn to hit my opponent to get to my spots. This is my opponent, this chair, is my defender. I have to learn to hit them in order to get to my spots. So I gotta handle the basketball and at the same time hit. I call it H2O, like water. Two H's are handle the ball and hit to get H2O. Think about that O for offense. Be like water, be flow. Put that in the comments below. I didn't mean to rhyme, but it was on time. I could do this all day, I guess. Learn how to play offense and defense by hitting. Now the two reads are simply this. If your defender's hands are out or up, you put your off hand by their waist hip area. So imagine this chair area being my defender's hips. And in this case, to kind of give you a human body so you can see, it'll be their right hip. This will be their right hip. So when I go by that hip, I want to hit that hip with my shoulders to their waist, playing low. I want to hit to get to my spot because the hit is going to pin my defender. And when I pin my defender, I'm going to open up their drive. See, now they have to open up their drive. Now look at what I have, a straight line drive. The second read, what you want to look out for, is now because the hands were out and up, you attack the hips. Now they're going to try to protect it. They're going to put those hands now down to their sides. Now here's the move you want to cue. When the, the hands are down, you want your wrist going over their wrist. You want to pin them now. I want to pin their wrists. So imagine again now, kind of same area, just kind of showing you here. Now I'm going to go the opposite way. I make that move, boom. Now my wrist is over their wrist. I want my palm down to the ground, that detail, my palm to the ground. Now my shoulders are going straight to my target. If my palms go up, I can belly out. I don't want to belly out. Look at that second step of a belly out. They can catch back up. Palms are to the ground. Now what I do, palms stay down to the ground as I hit. Look at that slight move of that chair. I have the right to go straight. I want to hit legally, not illegal. So I wanted to really give you a thorough explanation how to play defense also while playing offense while you attack your defenders. Having the chair in position, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna dribble to the chair, I'm gonna make a change of direction, but every time I do it, I'm gonna slightly hit it, right? That's my indicator of me making contact with my opponent, right? No matter what move I make, I wanna touch, right? I wanna touch my defender so they can feel me, right? As I make these moves, I always wanna have my active offhand ready to go. From high to low touch, right? High, low touch, right? I always want my defender to feel me as I go, right? Boom, I want them feeling me. I want you doing that two cycles of 45 seconds. You may have a live person, a parent, a coach, a teammate. Have them stay still. Have them give you a cue. They can point at their wrist. You got to put your offhand above their wrist. Have them point at their hip. Put your offhand at the hip, right? It's a cue. Cue the action, do the action. That's simple. Now let's go to the basket, let's attack. We're trying to reach 8,000 subscribers by the end of the month and we need your help. We roll out high quality videos every week to help you become a premium basketball player. Help us reach our goal and click that subscribe button. Mixing up my moves, I'm gonna do like three. Right side, middle, left side. Different moves, but every time I go by the chair, whether I'm changing speeds or not, whatever move I'm making, I gotta hit that chair. I have to make sure that on offense, the only time we don't want spacing, here's a key and a benefit, is when you're blowing by a defender. No space, none whatsoever, right? Tight, really tight. Basketball, your body, defender. That's the mentality you wanna have. Let's go to work, here I go. Make three. <laughs> Always catch him. Always touch them. Make them feel you. Make them feel you. Make them feel you. Make them feel you. Make them feel you every time. Man. Make them feel your game. Ah. Ah. Let's go. Move it on. Right, mix up your scoring options. Pull up jumpers, attack to the rack. Ah. Every time. Tap, touch. Every single time. Make sure you touch them. Touch him, hit him, shot. Mix up your scoring options too. 
Mix up your scoring options. Be playful. Have fun. Last three. Change speed. Change directions. One. Two. Off the glass. Three. There you have it. Active offhand. Cues. Hands are out. Hands are up. You're off hand to their hip. Hands are down. Pin them. You're off hand above their wrist. Let's go. I want to make sure we're taking your game to the next level. So I'd like to offer you a gift that covers all the must-know basketball principles. Click that link in the description below to download. And if you're really interested in becoming a premium basketball player or as a coach, taking your team to the next level, contact us for in-person training. That's right. We will travel to you and lead a customized camp, clinic, or a training session that I guarantee you as players and as coaches will take your mentality and your physical skills in basketball to the next level to dominate in every game. Enjoy your gift. Keep attacking. I look forward to talking to you soon.